Well, howdy everyone. I just want to do a quick video. I just got a PAR meter. It's a quantum PAR meter from uh, Quantum Sun makes this one. There's a few similar models for sale on Amazon. Um, this one is a replacement. Um, I had one that was almost identical and like an idiot I was in a hurry and I thought I was grabbing the USB cable and instead I was grabbing the sensor and I yanked out the sensor and that was the end of that so I had to buy a new one so this unit uh, it cost about 150 bucks um, comes with a case which I'll never use uh, you get a USB cable here to charge it and uh, there's some pretty basic instructions but uh, the heart of this is the meter itself uh, so basically what this does it reads the light it tells you what the par is uh, it measures light from 400 to 700 nanometers which is what plants can use and it tells you uh, how much light your plants are getting so we'll flip it on here and so right down here yeah we don't have much light but I'm gonna bring this up under the LED on my uh, air garden here and you can see I hope it's kind of hard to do one-handed that the closer I get to the light the higher the numbers go so this is kind of important because LEDs are pretty powerful and you can give your plants too much light. Uh, it doesn't happen usually but uh, it can happen and I do also grow in, in closets which are more confined. So you know too much light it can cause the leaves to bleach. It can actually cause small leaves and stunting so I like to monitor it. Um, you know this air garden here I just a quick uh, thing this is a jalapeno pepper it was cut back because peppers are perennial and uh, I expect to grow another plant I had another plant in here and I had a bad spider mite infestation so I decided it was easier to remove the plant I didn't really want the peppers from it anyway um, and I don't know what I'll put in the other cells eventually I'll probably go back to growing herbs in here but uh, you know these meters uh, they come in handy I can't live without them you may not want to spend that kind of money you may not have you know that kind of setup and that's fine uh, there are some apps that you can get on your phone that will do the same thing but um, I found they're not that accurate so when I wrecked my old one I just had to get a new one so anyhow um, pretty simple to use you just plug it in charge it up and then uh, this here is uh, receiving end it'll read what the par is and so you know like you can see I think you can see you can see this plant is getting about 500 something it varies because my hand is shaking but if I get it all the way up to the top it's getting about 460 micromoles uh, that's fine uh, most plants can handle 600 and once you get above 600 uh, they're getting too much light unless you have CO2 in your uh, closet and most vegetable growers do not run CO2 so uh, anyhow just a quick update and um, I'll put a link to this in the description if you're interested um, you can check it out on Amazon if you buy it I'll earn a small commission if you don't buy it that's fine too I just like to keep people updated on what I'm doing so till I see you again, take good care of yourselves, happy gardening, and keep it green. Alright, see you all later. Bye-bye.